All right. Welcome back to the Game Cave. I am Josh. This is Orphan. Hope you guys are having a great day. We're about to do this uh, boss battle. So settle in, get comfortable, and uh, let's do this. Okay. I can't target it. Ah. What am I targeting then? Oh, that's... Oh, I see. There's debris. Do I break the debris? What does breaking the debris do? Oh, it looks like she has a shield. Ah, okay. Got to break the debris to lower the shield. Her accuracy is terrible. Uh-oh. Oh, yeah. We got hops. There you go. Take that. I don't need to worry about projectiles hitting it. Oh, that's actually doing a lot of damage. Must be weak to ice. Yep, we don't take that shit. Hit it, hit it. Yeah. You're below me. There's no way that's going to hit me. Oh, never mind. I was wrong. Yeah, see, I don't take that shit. Mm -hmm. There you go. Come on, die. Oh. Yeah, not today. Boom! Easy peasy. Starting the episode off with an utter domination of a box. That's what I'm talking about. Now let's see what kind of smack she's going to talk after this. Now that was easy. Got that right, Orphan. Ooh, we got a spell. going to be a good one. Ice. Well, that's a shield. Oh, that was cool as shit. Does it hurt people that attack me? The Shield of Inferno reflects ice attacks back to all enemies. All right, that's cool. No. <laughs> no. Why'd she leave the egg? Well, well. Not so confident now, is she? I hope that's the last we'll see of her. Master! She left behind the crystal egg! Rufus? You were alive all this time? I am so sorry, Sefi. Oh, how I have missed you all these years. I heard... You had been killed. I was already as you see me now. I couldn't bear for you to see me like this, so old and helpless. Sefi, I didn't think I'd ever see you again. Oh, Rufus. We should get back to Gaia's tomb. Fast. Here, we're gonna... Oh, good. I'm actually grateful that they didn't make me run all the way back there. Well, we're back. Cleo, what happened? What's wrong with Ronnie? I don't know. She got worse all of a sudden. What? We're too late. Oh, my dearest Ronnie. Speak to me, Ronnie. Don't leave me. Orphan, 
Did you find the crystal egg? Yes, here it is. Miss Jada, look. We found the crystal egg. Now you can use it to heal Ronnie. Here. Oh, thank you. I didn't really believe you could find it. That's the real deal, Grandma. Now hurry up and cure the girl. Of course, but... Uh... But what? Oh, wait. No, don't tell me. You don't know how to use the crystal egg? Well, actually, no, I don't. Oh, for... The legend of the crystal egg has been passed down in my family for generations, but I've never actually seen it. It should have the power to save her, though. Huh? Oh, you've got to be kidding me! We went through all that for nothing? I don't know if there's anything else we can do for her. Ronnie's life is in the hands of the gods now. I take small comfort in knowing that we'll be together in the next life. We shouldn't have long to wait. What are you talking about? I can break the spell Curus has cast on her. Rufus! Who are you? Oh, this is Rufus. Curus did experiments on him as well. Oh, you have the same sickness as Ronnie. Are you sure? Yes. I know more about the crystal egg than just about anyone, but I must start immediately. There isn't much time. Please, step back. I am ready to begin. Rufus. Sefi, I'm glad I got to see you one more time. But Rufus... Guardian of time, I demand, guide us to the true path! Look, the egg! What the... sorcery? No, it's something different. That was an epic incantation. Oh, Ronnie! He did it! Grandma, am I cured? These young people found the crystal egg and saved your life. Rufus! Why, Rufus? Sefi, thank you so much for coming. It's okay. It's my time to go. No! Don't say that, Rufus. <laughs> Master? There's nothing I can do, Magnus. Rufus. <laughs> you knew, didn't you? You knew the crystal egg could only be used once before it shattered. Oh, you always did have to have things your way. Oh, Rufus. Oh, Sefi. You understand me so well. All this time, I never thought I would see you again. And now, finally, when we're together again, oh, how I wish things were different. Oh, Rufus. Your eyes still sparkle as brightly now as they did when you were young. Oh, I'll never forget the precious time we spent together. I remember all of the wonderful stories you used to tell me and... and I traveled the world and wasted the best years of my life searching for treasure. What a fool I was. All that time, the greatest treasure of all was right under my nose. You were my one true treasure, Sefi. Only you. Rufus. Sefi, I love you. Rufus. Rufus. No. <laughs> I don't understand. Couldn't he have saved himself? Well, whoa, 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 that camera was unnecessary. Damn. I hope my last words can be I love you. Yeah, this voice acting really takes it up. Don't miss her or thing. Yeah, you wish. Orphan, I have decided to remain here on Chaos Island. I will watch over Rufus's grave until we meet again in the afterlife. Here is my payment as promised. 
It's not much, but it's valuable to me. Why would someone that beautiful want to spend her whole life all alone on a stupid island like that? I just don't get it. How happy could she be tending a grave? Magnus, that's because you're still just a little boy. That's what true love is all about. If staying there makes her happy, then that's all that matters. If you say so. Well, I do say so. You're just too young to understand. You'll learn someday. Oh, we back to this. Three years younger than you. Uh. Everybody knows girls are more mature than boys, and you're the living proof. What's that bauble? Oh, whoa. Did we win? Long have I waited for your coming. Forever imprisoned here by the chains of eternity. Ronnie? Unfortunately, there is little I can do except wait. You have done well, Orphan. Very well. But your true destiny still awaits before you, unfulfilled. Here I will remain, waiting. The stage has been set for you to return. Orphan, you are my only hope. Obi-Wan Kenobi. Ah, <laughs> oh, the chains of eternity. That's awesome. Yes, save the game. Okay, turn to game. Yes. That's the Egg of Destiny. Or Egg of Time, whatever the frick it was called. Play again to fulfill your destiny. Oh, yeah. Okay, so this is probably where a lot of people stop playing the game, right? Hit <laughs> yes, and this is basically a new game plus prompt. What is this? Haven't I been here before? This is weird. Ah! Okay, so it's not a dream. Then what the hell's going on? <laughs> Magnus! Cleo! Where are you? Answer me! Alright, so... Some of you may recognize this from the first couple episodes. This is the ship that you start out on. And this treasure chest is for your new game plus sword. Yes, I distinctly remember that. It is a stronger version. Whoops. It is a stronger version of the original sword. And oh, oh, and it's fire. Oh, I don't know if I remember that. I just remember that you got a badass sword. Maybe it's not even stronger. Maybe it's just fire elemental. Hmm. Who can say? You know what we're going to do? We're going to put on the fire sword. And then we're going to have the fire shield and the fire spell. And we're just going to be man of fire. God help any water monsters that come across us. And then we're going to hop down. So everything is the same. Hey, Magnus. Oh, huh. relax. It's just me. Oh, master. Am I glad to see you? I keep hearing this spooky flute. What flute? I don't hear anything. Hey, can you tell me what exactly is going on around here? I don't know. There's no one else left on the ship. Where do they all go? What's that? See? See? Do you hear that? That's it. That's the flute I was talking about. Hmm. I better check it out. Wait here. I'll be right back. Spooky flute. A spook. I'll be completely honest. Um, I do not remember him being here. Because when you're first here on, you know, your first playthrough, obviously he's standing here with Sefi. Sefi is no longer here. But if you come up here and boom, Chloe is here talking to Thor. 
or Zeus or whatever the hell this damn name is. Which, you know, they're here on your first playthrough and you can either pick to talk to her or Magnus. You don't have to play Magnus first. You can play uh, Chloe's storyline first. I don't know if certain elements are different in Magnus's story if you play Chloe's first, but I do know that... Um, no, I don't know that. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. We're going to go. I'm not going to claim to know things. Drunk camera! Uh, Orpin, where have you been? <laughs> that so, color filter. you're not dead yet. Thanks to this gentleman. Uh, and you are? I am Zeus, the mercenary. Unless I'm mistaken, you must be a sorcerer. That's right. The name is Orphan. Yes, allow Zeus to join well, my Zeus, party. This is how I see it. We're in a tight spot here. We'll have a much better chance of surviving if we work together. Well said, Master Orphan. There's always safety in numbers. Oh, it's the first boss. Memory. Oh no, we're sinking. You two, find someplace safe. I'll handle this one myself. Am I gonna have to fight it again? Or is it just gonna skip it? Wee! Floaty jump. No music. There's the music. Some good ass music. Okay, here we go. I don't remember the tactics. Uh, I think it's I charged the hand of Pyro. Yeah. Okay. So I hand I charge hand of Pyro to the end of him saying Pyro. Let it go. Then block. He's gonna get mad. Yep. Whoops. Was not paying attention. I don't know why. I took my eyes off the screen. Damn it. Shout out to do it. I hope I don't die. Oh, he's gonna. Alright. Gonna get him with the fire sword. Dynamic battlefield. Are we done? There you go. Alright, we did the thing that we've already done before. Man, these sound effects are really loud. I haven't adjusted the volume or anything. This is, this is absurd. Hey, CG. <laughs> we get to see this all over again. Yeah. Oh. Orphan, 
Wake up! What do I have to do to get you up? Ugh, ugh. I must have passed out. What is this place? It's Anarchy Island or something like that. Hmm. Anarchy Island, huh? Chaos Island. Oh, yeah, that's it. Chaos Island. Zeus says that our ship was headed for Chaos Island all along. What? Vulcan put us on the wrong ship. I knew it! We should never have trusted that demented idiot! We? You're the one who trusted him! Anyway, where's Magnus? How the hell should I know? What about you, Zeus? You haven't seen Magnus around here anywhere, have you? Your young traveling companion? No, I'm afraid not. Uh, by the way, what shall I call you? Was it Miss Cleo? No, no, that sounds so stuffy. Just Cleo would be fine. I have a daughter, a little bit younger than you. I came looking for her. Now I think perhaps it was a mistake to come here. Huh? Uh, excuse me, I didn't... Uh, you... you reminded me of her. It has been ten years now since my wife left and took my daughter with her. I've heard news that my wife has died, and that my daughter is living alone, somewhere on this island. Wow, a ten-year reunion! That's great! I just love stories like this. Father and daughter together at last. Oh, man. Where's my hanky? <laughs> I think I'm gonna cry. But now I don't know if coming was the right thing to do. When I find her, what do I say? What do I do? It's been so long, I don't even know if she'll recognize me. Well, don't worry. You're her father. I just know she'll be happy to see you. I hope you're right. Well, you sure sound confident. So, do you know where your daughter is? No. All I know is that she is somewhere on this island. But I was expecting the island to be much smaller. I'm afraid this may take longer than I had planned. We've got to help him find his daughter. Right, Orphan? Hmm. Well, why not? It'll be fun, don't you think? Come on. I don't know, Cleo. Orphan, what is your problem? It'll be so beautiful. Father and daughter reunited again after years apart. Oh, Orphan, pretty please? I can't believe I'm getting into this mess. Orphan, thank you. You know, there could be more monsters out there. We're gonna need your help to get off this island anyway, Zeus. Understood. But keep in mind, we're just trying to get off this island. If we find your daughter, that's great. But it's just like you said. She may not even want to see you. And what makes you such an expert on father-daughter relationships, Orphan? Oh, shut up. It's just a reality check. Master Orphan is right. I have no right to expect anything after all these years. But if nothing else, I would be satisfied with just one glimpse of my daughter, alive and well. Aw, Zeus. Enough already. This is getting way too sappy for me. Come on, Zeus. Let's get moving. Yay! We're off! Why did the camera keep panning behind those pillars? These are questions that need answers. And maybe they'll get answered on the next episode, because that's the end of this one. Guys, thank you so much for watching these videos. It means a lot to me. And if you are enjoying the videos, make sure you hit that like button, comment and subscribe, and hit that bell, because we got a lot more things rolling out. And you can keep up with us if you follow us on our social media. Links down in the description. And don't forget that I stream on twitch.tv slash TGC The Game Cave. 3 p.m. to 11 p.m. Monday to Friday, Eastern Standard Time. Hope we can catch you there. At any rate, we'll see you next time. Bye.